I'm Jessica Cartaglia with your evening digital news brief for Monday, November 12. A plea for help from Philadelphia police after four hit and run crashes over a three day period. The crashes happened across the city from Friday night through Sunday morning. Three of the crashes were deadly. The youngest victim just 17 years old. Investigators are tracking down leads, but they say they need the public's help to find the drivers involved. The death toll continues to climb as devastating wildfires burn across California. At least 31 people have died. Nearly 230 people are still unaccounted for. The flames have scorched more than 325 square miles. That's more than twice the size of Philadelphia. We also learned today that Philly's manager Gabe Kapler lost his Malibu home in the wildfires, but fortunately his family was not injured. Fire officials are trying to figure out what sparked this fire in an historic home in Montgomery County. The flames swept through the home on the 2100 block of Turwood Road in Upper Moreland Township this morning. No one was hurt in the fire. Prosecutors are reviewing video of a casino incident involving Atlantic City Mayor Frank Gilliam and City Councilman Jeffrey Fauntleroy. The press of Atlantic City says it viewed a video of a fight outside the Golden Nuggets Haven nightclub. It allegedly shows Mayor Gilliam throwing punches and Fauntleroy throwing someone on the ground. Both men acknowledged the incident to the paper but did not talk about what started that fight. Remember, you can always get the latest on these stories and much more right here on CBSPhilly.com. That's the latest for the Evening Digital Brief. I'm Jessica Cartaglia.